The Philadelphia 76ers, they, they won a basketball game. Yeah, they won a game. They win it tonight. Almost couldn't close the deal again. Well, they didn't close the deal in regulation, but they pull away with the win in overtime. Joel Embiid. So, he kind of struggled tonight, at least for the most part, at least most of the night, but he scores 13 points from the four-minute mark of regulation till the end of the game. And he did that in like six minutes because he didn't play in the first three minutes of overtime. But, man, dude, like, none of these teams in Philly right now can close. Ugh. Gerald Henderson, what the fuck are you doing? Ugh. Man. Flyers couldn't close tonight. Weds can't lead the Eagles on a fourth quarter drive. I mean, Jesus Christ. Th these teams are like that guy at the bar who's hitting on the same girl all night, you know, buying her all these drinks, only for some schmuck, and, you know, to show up at the end of the night and take her away from them. That's what these teams are doing right now. They just can't close. Nobody can. It's unbelievable. But back to Embiid. You know, he only went 6 of 18 from the floor, but he got to the foul line a lot. 12 of 14 from the foul line. 7-2 guy went 12 of 14 from the foul line. How about that? Crazy shit. Uh, he had, you know, this awesome block on Al Jefferson. Uh, Jefferson had, you know, a quick drop step from the right block. He recovers in time, still gets the block. That was pretty awesome. Uh, what else did he do? I, I, it seems like, well, well, we'll see what happens moving forward, but it seems like uh, the Pacers tonight and, and even the other night, when Embiid struggled a little bit uh, against the Jazz, teams are staying down more on his pump fake uh, from beyond the arc. So uh, teams, it seems like teams are just looking at some tape and, you know, they're defending him a little bit better. Embiid took some tough shots tonight, tough step-back shots. He had a, a one-footed fadeaway uh, there in overtime, I believe. So uh, taking some really difficult shots, but, you know, he hit a couple too. Um, the one, the three-point play against LaVoy Allen, uh, fights for post position, you know, uh, quickly uh, gets to the rim there and, and puts in the layup plus the foul. Uh, he hit a three-pointer tonight again. I mean, he's shooting like 50% from three right now. I don't know what the official numbers are, but uh, he was shooting like 66% from three the other day, and he was leading the NBA. At that point, he was qualified. I don't think he's qualified anymore. So, yeah, big win for the Sixers tonight. Well, first win. I don't know if it's big or anything, <laughs> considering how many wins this team's going to not get this year. But, yeah, it's nice to get off the schneid. Um, I, I thought it was funny tonight. They, Allen Iverson was in attendance, and he was so cool that he refused to do the mannequin challenge. Yeah. So he had, like, World Be Free doing the mannequin challenge, all these guys. He, he's just sitting there putting the threes up. He's, he's putting the three ball up. So that I thought that was really funny. Uh, Nick Stauskas, actually, you know, I'll tell you what, I, I wasn't a big Nick Stauskas fan coming into this season, but he has sneakily played better than I thought he would. Uh, he had, you know, a pretty good stretch tonight. Uh, had, had this sequence where uh, he drove from the left wing, made this acrobatic layup, like a minute later he hits a left corner three. So he's been providing some more spark than I thought. Still can't play a lick of defense, but, you know. Hey, he's bringing more to the table than I thought he would. And talk about not playing defense. Gerald Henderson. Mmm. Mmm. Gerald Henderson. You know, he, he takes bad shots at the end of games. He loses the ball, even though you could argue that sometimes he gets fouled. But that's more on, you know, him just being an idiot and, and uh, not giving the ball up. Commits a stupid foul tonight. Like, what are you doing, dude? Ugh. But, hey, Sixers win it. Um, yeah, we'll see, we'll see uh, how MB plays moving forward because uh, teams were staying down on that pump fake tonight, uh, well, the last couple games, so we'll see. But, man, you know, he's, he's getting to the line. I mean, he got to the line 14 times. Uh, you know, he can do a lot of different things. So even if teams are staying down on the pump fake, maybe he'll hit the block a little bit harder now because uh, he had, you know, a lot of post touches tonight. It was, well, it seemed like he had more post touches than he normally does. So, yeah. Uh, that's about it. Sixers won a basketball game. Uh, the Pacers are still winless on the road. And the Sixers exact a little bit of revenge. So, I'm Adrian. I'm out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the win. Yeah.